The day is not far when from the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. I would like to invite our final speaker of the day, Maulana Abbas Abdi, to please deliver the closing keynote. Thank you. Dear brothers and sisters, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. As a student of Islamic sciences, I would like to congratulate you for having this great protest and demonstration to show the solidarity to, toward the oppressed people in the planet. As we know that Islam is the, not only the religion of peace, but it is the promoter of the peace in this world. No matter the Zionist media's propaganda, what he, they, they say, but the reality is that Islam is the peace, promoting the peace and security. And we are Muslims. That means we are peace seekers, peace providers, and peace lovers. But unfortunately, this peace is disturbed because of injustice. Justice is the soul of the values of humanity. If there is no justice, there, there, can, there cannot be the peace. Everyone should be fair with other. Every even man in this earth should be just with other, even with animals, even with tiny creature. Everyone should be fair and just with others. But unfortunately, some opportunists, some the worshippers of the desires and passions, those who are looking for the power through the illegal ways, they disturb the peace, the peace through doing injustice with, uh, to others. The all oppressors are condemned by the creator, the Lord of universe. And we are here to show that we are the creator of Allah and we should also do the same to condemn the oppressor, oppressors in the world. As Quran says, وَلَا تَرْكَلُوا إِلَى الَّذِينَ ظَلَمُوا فَتَمَسَّكُمُ النَّارِ وَمَا لَكُمْ مِن دُونِ اللَّهِ مِنْ أَوْلِيَاءِ ثُمَّ لَا تُنْصَرُونَ Do not incline toward the oppressors, lest the fire should touch you, and you will not have any friend besides Allah. Then you will not be helped. So we are here to fulfill this command of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And also we are the follower of our beloved divine Imam, Imam Ali alayhi salatu wa salam. And he used to advise us in several occasions that Kunu li khasman wa li awna. Be always with the oppressed people. Support them, assist them, try to help them, but do not associate or assist with the oppressors. Here, unfortunately, the world is full of oppression, the full of injustice. Why? Because some supporting an illegal state called Israel. And now, after all these media's propaganda, many people, all people, those who are free, they believe that Zionism is the mother of terrorism. Zionism is the mother of extremism. Zionism is the mother of oppression across the world. Yes. Zionism is the mother of al yes. The Zionism is the father of al yes. Zionism is the mother of ISIS. Yes. Don't say Islamic State. Say Israeli State in Iraq and Sham. Yes. So we should all be united against all kind of injustice in this world. 
in order to at least demonstrate that we are alive because the life is not just eating and drinking and sleeping life has some signs the biggest sign is to stand firmly against oppressors and the oppression we should not be in just with anyone and we should not also support by keeping ourselves silent unfortunately in this world many people they support quietly by being silent against this oppression they don't speak up so we are here to show that we are alive and we do speak up against terrorism against oppression and against zionism which is the main source of all problems assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi